so awkward to just like open up my FaceTime <laughs> yeah, 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 and see yeah. him in bed with his like meal in front of him. I don't, I don't like this. Wearing a bathrobe. Funny. I think it's funny. No. Yeah, no, I don't. don't th- like I this. don't think it's supposed to be funny, but I think it it's was... funny. So Louis got bumbled, but not on Bumble. He met Andrea on Bumble. You know, you know, sometimes you match with someone on Bumble. They're like, "Oh, hey, hottie, how are you?" Yeah, and yeah. then, and they're like, "Great, how are you doing?" And you never hear from them again. Yeah, they just want the match to stay. Yeah, Louis had that happen in real life. Louis, can you explain? Can you explain what happened with you and Andrea? So, uh, yeah, so I met this girl Andrea, and she was just like, she was amazing. Uh, as you said, you know, we met on Bumble. Uh, we went out for dinner at, at Joey's, and then, you know, she was she was exactly my type. It, it, it was it, she was perfect, right? And then, you know, after that date, we kept messaging and everything was going awesome. And, and we planned another date for the following Friday. But then all of a sudden, you know, on Thursday, I get a message from my buddy. And it says that he it basically said that his brother had tested COVID positive. Okay. Ooh, right? that sucks. And, yeah, exactly. So, so basically, I went and I got my test. And, you know, two days later, it came back negative. So I, it was all good in that regard. And I okay. texted Andrea and I was just like, and I was just like, look, can we like maybe reschedule? Didn't get a response. Right. So that I'm so I message her the next day, still no response. But then here's the thing it's like Andrea, like I know she's a nurse. And so obviously that's a really, really sensitive kind of thing. Right. Like, you know, like she can't yeah. risk course, getting yeah. infected at all. Right. Frontline workers and all that. Anyway, long story short, uh, uh, you know, like I, I, I think I might have scared her away with it when I went to have to go get the test. And, and I just having not heard back from her, I just feel like that's probably the case is that she just got scared away. It is such a weird world mm-hmm. out there. And you're, you're thinking, then Isn't you're double right? thinking, then you're overthinking, yeah. and there's more thinking. And everyone's just trying yeah. to be polite to each other about sharing information about where they've been and, and if they've been infected. Yeah. It's so much. So I can see where you're coming from. And I'm sorry that you're in your head and we're going to get to the bottom of this. I, I feel for this Thank guy. You. Let's make the call. Hey, Andrea, um, it's uh, Adam Wilde, TJ, and Jax from 99.9 Virgin Radio calling to talk about a guy named Louie. Oh, um, hi. Yeah. Hi. Um, Louie, yeah, yeah. He's a nice guy. Um, I'm not sure how much I can help you. I've only known him for a few weeks. Honestly, we really just need one question answered. Yeah. And we know you can answer this one because it involves you. <laughs> um, uh, oh. Uh, you, yeah. Yeah, oh, you ghosted him. What you happened? messaging him. Why? Um, okay. Uh, yeah, I did ghost him. Um, when, when we did have a nice date, it's just, uh, he kept trying to FaceTime me, and I'm just, I'm not into that at all. And I told him that, but he just kept doing it. <laughs> Wait a second. <laughs> like FaceTime with his is. with his face? <laughs> yeah, like, you know. Oh, I'm you mean not naked body? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. No, 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 yeah. no, no, no. Nothing no. weird, okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Well, I mean, maybe he was. I didn't answer a lot of those. Yeah. <laughs> so, I, 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 I'm curious. Was this before or after you met? Um, so this was after we met. Um, oh. But uh, so, Love like, it. we did have a, a good um, a good first date. But then, like, afterwards, um, he had to cancel because of COVID. Yeah. And um, in between waiting for the results and everything, he was just constantly trying to do those FaceTime calls and um, he wanted to I guess make up for the cancelled date (laughs) and then one time I just gave up and I answered and he was just I swear he was sitting in bed and he's like hey I'm eating dinner want to join Um, I'm not kidding you it was so awkward to just like open up my face <laughs> yeah, and yeah, see yeah. him in bed with his like meal in front of him. I don't, I don't like this. Wearing I think a it's funny. I think it's funny. No, yeah, no, I don't. don't th- like I don't think it's supposed to be funny, but I think it it's was funny. So <laughs> awkward. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> I'm living for this. Okay, all right, all right. Yeah. <laughs> so, okay. I just told him I couldn't talk, and I like hung up. I, I, yeah. I just put, I didn't message him again you after gotta, that. You gotta I, eat alone, I felt buddy. Weird. That's yeah. so freaking weird. Also, okay, eating in bed is a whole different thing. That's weird. Okay. Yeah. Um, now, all right. Let's. It seems like there's two things happening here. We got the FaceTimes that yeah. are very awkward and weird, That's which I'm, I grant you, it's weird. <laughs> this the the other thing though is that you went on a date and you guys really got along great, right? Um, I mean, yeah, but you know, like you, 
first dates are, are good. So, I mean, like sometimes people can give off a really good impression. So, totally. Mm-hmm. And then FaceTime and, you from you the know. bed. So here's, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this is so yeah. weird. Okay, here's what I'm going to propose. And this, this offer, of course, comes with no pressure, okay? We okay. would offer to pick up the tab if you would be willing to go on another date with Louie. Only if you're comfortable. But, you know, it seemed like you guys sort of vibed yeah. on the first date and maybe... Maybe he's just a weird guy on, you know, some people are weird over text, right? Or weird over phones. I don't think it's that weird. Why would we be so weird? <laughs> yeah. Okay, why don't you think it's weird? I'm interested. Sometimes it's nice to have face-to-face contact. Yeah, but shouldn't the other person gonna... want that? Yeah. But, yeah. <laughs> I love to pop up and surprise Fair. people with FaceTime. So you do. Not you FaceTime second... all the okay. time. So, yeah, so, Andrea, what do you think? Um, Yeah, actually, Louis was really nice on the first date. And, and um, I do feel bad for ghosting him, so I... I guess I'll take that free date. <laughs> okay. Look at that. Now, you know what's funny about that? Andrea clearly is a, a nurse because she has mad patience. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, by the way, Andrea, Very we're going to need sweet. some of that patience Very now sweet. because I'm going to tell you that Louis has been listening this entire time. From his bed. <laughs> <laughs> no way. Really? Louis? Louis live. Yep. Hey, Andrea. How you doing? <laughs> Hi, Louis. Um... <laughs> <laughs> wow. You know what? Let's I, connect I, to you guys. Hang no, on. no, yeah. stop it. Stop. Yeah. <laughs> uh, no, uh, stop yeah. the FaceTime. Stop the uh, FaceTime. All right, all right, all right. So, <laughs> so Louis, you want to explain the FaceTime thing, please? Yes, see, absolutely. Listen, I am I am so sorry about that. Uh, look, I, I, I've got a bunch of friends who have been, you know, trying out this whole, like, you know, Zoom dating and, like, online and FaceTime dating kind of thing during quarantine. And I just, you know, I just thought I would give it a try. And, and now, you know, hearing you talk about it, I realize how horrible it was. Um, <laughs> just please realize the only reason I had my dinner in my bed is because I live in a very small apartment with a roommate. And that roommate is always in the living room playing video games. So I just think like, I had to He's sort of yeah. move my... I had to move myself to a different room, and and I I only realize now how terrible that must have looked. Louis, stop. Uh, Louis, and, stop. And, yeah, I just. No, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. No, yeah. I, I think that's a reasonable explanation. It's okay, so, so sweet. So here's the thing. And yeah, then, actually, yeah, go ahead, Andrea. I mean, yeah, I I do hope you realize that it was a really weird thing to do, though. <laughs> but like. I, I can kind of, Absolutely. I can kind of see that, yeah. Man, how great oh, is man. their wedding going to be? I know. Oh my god! Every That's once in a while, we have a couple on ghosting. And you're like, oh, they're going to have kids. Yeah. Yeah. And guess what, you two? Yeah. You're going to have yeah. kids. You're on the Listen, list now. Listen, we're, we're we're not going to put that on you, but we are, we are. so excited for you both. Uh, enjoy your second date. May it be socially distanced and safe. Yeah. And uh, and and no more Facetimes until both parties are in. Okay. Keep being sweet to each other. Absolutely. Thank you guys so much. Yeah. What do you guys think? In private or public schools?